Hi, this is Rabbi Fleschel giving you something special on Animal Torah. And with me today I have Roxy. She's obviously a dog. But what's significant about her is that I've never heard her bark. In this week's Torah portion, God says to the Jewish people, you're going to leave Egypt and the dogs are not going to bark. What is the significance of that? Today when people say the dog didn't bark, it means the event didn't happen. But God had just caused tremendous miracle in Egypt with the 10 plagues and then afterwards the Jews get ready to leave it causes another miracle the dogs don't bark but why he didn't want the Jews to leave in disgrace he didn't want them to leave in discomfort he wanted them to leave as kings and that's how they left the dogs acted in that way and they were actually rewarded for that what's significant about dogs is that the Hebrew word for dog is kelev Kelev means like a heart, right? What does it mean like a heart? Is that they have emotion, tremendous emotion, and they have a tremendous emotional bond to man. This is Rabbi Fleschel giving you something special on Animal Torah.